Hi everyone and welcome in this new video tutorial. I'm Arian and today we're going to see how to create a custom language switcher. Of course I'm using VPML. If you didn't see my last video on how to install the multi-language plugin called VPML, check in the description of this video, you will find all the links of the plugins and of course the link to the tutorial. Great! So once you have your VPML plugin installed and you have your multi-language website, of course we need to add a language selector and in this case we are going to customize our own. Let's start right away. So VPML languages, click on it and now check on the menu language switcher, you should see something like that, so you should have nothing here and widget language switcher. Uh, you should see something like this and of course we need to enable the custom language switchers. So if I click on enable as you can see now I have a customize button and I can click on it and of course now we can change our settings and I usually get on the drop down here so first option it's drop down language name current language current language like that so that's great and of course you can change some borders and whatever you want I will keep it like this and then click on save go on my templates here team builder and now I will edit with Elementor my previous header that I made in my previous tutorial so edit with Elementor great now I would like to add my language switcher just on the left of my menu so to do that just go on here short code drag and drop the short code on the top of the menu of course I'm going to paste now a code that I will leave you in the description of this video great once you pasted your code as you can see there is our language selection and we need to edit this by going on advanced and then positioning width change to inline auto and now as you can see it works well so I'm going to save, update the page now and then check it how it looks. I can hard refresh or go on the home page and hard refresh it. And as you can see now I have my menu here. So I want to make it a little bit more minimal. I want it to on the left of course, I need to reduce the space and everything. So to do that, just go on here, back to WordPress go on VPML languages and then here on site languages you will find a link called edit languages I can click on it just change this to EN and of course same thing here EN and Italian IT and here the same thing IT great now I can save the edits, if you are not able to save this, just randomly click like that and usually you should have the save button working fine, it's a little bug that happens. Great, once you saved, now you can go on your website and as you can see we have the AN and the IT, cool. So the thing is, this pacing isn't very nice, so we need to add a custom code, a CSS that I will leave in the description of this video. And so let's get back on WordPress and then let's go on VPML again, languages, and then I'm going down an additional CSS, click on here. I will paste the code that I will leave in the description. This. Usually the saving system works automatically and then you can go and on your website as you can see now you have your language switcher working fine with no extra spacing. And of course if you want to fix as you can see it's uh, not in line with the menu just go on edit with Elementor menu site as you can see it's a header so this is the correct template to edit click on it and then just click on this column here icon and vertical alignment just make it middle now as you can see everything's aligned I can just update the page check the mobile version it's working fine desktop version so let's check out our website and yeah and here we are we can now switch to an Italian language as you can see, an English language with our custom uh, language selector. 
Great, I remember you that there is many tutorials on my channel and of course if this video was useful to you just click thumbs up and subscribe to the channel notification bell to get always notified and to support my work and yeah see you in the next video bye